So today we are in Epcot because we are gonna be doing the spice pollination exploration. So two years ago we did the extravaganza, now they've got the pollination exploration. We sucked at the extravaganza. We did it in four hours or something like that. But this one looks even tougher yeah. because the other one you just had to find like an egg in each land. And now basically you get like a vague description of I think there are gonna be like topiaries and stuff to do with the festival. So now we're going to Donald and his nephews because that's one we know. We, we feel like we know where that's gonna be. So we've reached our three nephews. Ruben saw a little bee. Spike. I saw a spike. Okay, so now so it's clear what we need to do. We've got to locate Spike and see on which flower he is, so or on which plant. Here we have the Dianthus. So here we have our stickers. stickers. Our sticker pack. And this is, and this is the, the map. map. And we're here at Donald and his nephew. So. Alright. One down. Many more to go. There are 11 to go. So we just used our map and our festival guide and think that the Future World Family Zone is here with the playground <laughs> Bo Peep. So here we have the playground with the Bo Peep. By the way, our cream. But there we have him, like pollinating what looks like... Gallardia. Two down. We are nailing this. <laughs> Hello. But will they? Are they like in order? So should this be more to the entrance? This can be. I don't know. Are we gonna like try? Maybe perhaps. Yeah, let's do that. We're gonna try. So we think the next clue stars of the show garden will be Nikki and Minnie, but we're not the, sure. It should be like they are the stars. So uh, we're now heading towards them. We can. We can totally be wrong with, with this one. Yeah. But it's worth a try. Yeah. Okay, so we just went around Mickey and Minnie. And we failed. <laughs> so we just stumbled upon the Honey Bistro sign. And we even remembered that there was a Honey Bistro on the map. So we're gonna go and see we can find our bee. Here. There are some bees already. Not the bee we're looking for. Where could he be? Where is Spike? Where could he be? Where could he be? Oh, there he is. And he is located on a kind of a lily. Okay. So we walked on over to England because there's a Shakespeare and a tea. English tea garden. So. so we feel like there should be oh. at least one in England. Here, here oh. we have the Shakespeare garden. Alrighty. Can't see the So we've got Shakespeare in the center. That's a and Spike. Well, he's subtle. Is down there. Yeah, you can see it here. And he's standing on the honeysuckle. So let's put it on the map. So now there's a what? There's still the tea garden. I the feel English like tea it's where, where, where you can meet. Well, I see there that's Twining's tea. Where you can meet. I feel like that's gonna be where you can meet Alice, where we met her last yeah. time. Like, they had like the little tea flavors. And they make Twining uh, commercial. The best so. tea ever, by the way. So we are now at the Twining's tea shop in the Twining's tea garden. So, uh, Yes, I see him already. There he is behind our... Oh, okay, they make pretty obvious here. So we've got our of little course, friend oh. at the Camellia. Camellia? You're nailing this, Ruben. Yeah, but I I think the, the extravaganza, the locations were more difficult because like there you have to look everywhere and in shops and, and all that kind of stuff and like here you just have to find your little cutie we're working our way down to France for, for the French, French garden so. I've got a feeling it's gonna be with the bell topiary she's, awesome. a, she's a prominent or, or, the, or with Kermit, Kermit apparently I don't see a bee no in here, it's 
piggy, not a bee. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Oh, look, there he is. On the rose, obviously. How many? Two, four, six to go. We're really good at this. Better than the extra vacancy. Yeah. <laughs> so the next one. The Urban on Spice Garden. So we believe it's in Morocco. Here's the Urban Spice Garden. Why do they sometimes have like the name of the garden and sometimes they don't? It would have been a lot easier if it was on maps. Of course, shitty. Ah, uh, there he is. Next up we have... Coco Dama Garden. That sounds very exciting as well. So since the next one is Smokehouse, which is definitely going to be America, we feel like this one should be somewhere here in Japan. So we're trying to locate it right now. Yes, that is the one. And I see our little pal already. Moving in closer, moving in closer. So the Kodama Garden with the iris. So we got a little sidetracked. I wanted to eat a funnel cake. And our view includes all the way in the back. In the back, our spike. So we just finished our funnel cake and I'm gonna show you our friend. So he's right this beautiful so far with Mickey and Minnie. Chilling in the sunflower. So we're gonna tell Ruben so we can put it on our mat. Next up is the Garden Italiano. So that will be in Norway. So we are on our way to Italy. We are in Italy. We are already in Italy. It's like uh, that quick. We're looking are. for the Garden Italiano. To find, once again, where our bee is hiding out. All right, so. We spotted him. Spotted him, there's again the blue signage. We get to the other side, so the Garden Italiano. And then over here, we have our Artichoke. Artichoke. Artichoke, apparently. So our next place is gonna take us to the tropical rainforest. Rainforest, which I don't think is gonna be in Germany. So uh, no, I think, but Mexico. Mexico, yeah. Mexico sounds Mexico. tropical. So we have made it to Mexico. Mexico. Will there be somewhere in here? Or? That's, good. That's gonna be too hidden. There's blue signage. Okay, so we're gonna go in. I'm gonna leave it here and walk. Oh. There's there an orchid, but where is our friend? Oh, there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> there he is. Case. So, orchid. Right here, which leaves for Daisy starts of the show yeah. garden. You can stick it. You can stick it on. But we will try to find we'll it. We'll try to find it. We can stick it on. Look at our beautiful map. Ruben totally ruined our sticker. There you have it, folks. And we're gonna go to one of the two locations and get our prize. So if you come back and bring your finished map, you can choose one of the patch sets. So we've got a mini one, just a seasonal one, there's a Mickey one, and a figment one. So they're like, the way they set up the festival this year is each part of it had a different like, merchandise segment. So they all correspond with one of the segments. And but which one did we choose? Which one did we choose? Ruben, you didn't get a say at all? No. Uh, no. Of course, we had to go for pigment. So one is pigment, the other one is let your imagination grow wild, and and then the Epcot Flower and Art Festival 2019. So that's pretty cool, and you get to keep your map as a souvenir as well. They just put a stamp on it so that they know you have collected your gift. So we were on our way to the DVC member lounge until we saw Daisy with a bunch of stars. So we are guessing that this is going to be the final spot 
of our scavenger hunt that we missed. We found them all. I think I see them already. Oh my gosh. Uh, all right, so there's the plaza of the stars. We should have known this in advance though. So this is the final ending of our scavenger hunt. We found them all. Success rate 100% up top. So this year it didn't take us that long, but I'm so happy. I thought the figment ones are gonna be sold out already. So it's pretty fun. It's a nice way to spend your day also. Yeah, a lot of walking. Yeah. You can combine it by just doing like the regular World Showcase and enjoying World Showcase while doing this. We decided to just go for it and look for <laughs> and look for all the plants separately, which was a lot of fun. We had a great time. So now we're off to just exploring World Showcase as regular as regular park guests. And we will see you next week. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye guys. Bye.